we uh, we played pretty well tonight. Um, I thought on the offensive end, the ball really moved, especially in the first half. We were active. Um, it got from spot to spot quickly, and guys make simple plays, and it helps when, when Steven goes for 20 in the first half, so it doesn't hurt. And then uh, after really the first four or five minutes, I give Asadula credit for coming out and making shots. But after the first four or five minutes, I thought we were much more uh, – much better defensively. For, started forcing them to, to, to take some tougher shots or throw some tougher passes, and you combine that with making shots, and you're probably in for a good night. I thought it, we we certainly had our moments. It wasn't perfect. Um, there were clearly things out there that we need to work on um, moving forward that we didn't handle well, especially early. Um, but I thought that overall, yeah, we did we did a pretty good job. But we've been doing that all year long, really, especially since the league play started. We've been the best defensive team in the league by a lot, and uh, I don't think that changed today. Um, I mean, just kind of going off what Coach said. I mean, just. Knowing the scout, knowing personnel, I mean, that was the biggest thing about uh, Navy is just being locked in on defense. And I think once we were able to get stops, I think that led to a lot of transition and uh, getting better flow on offense. So, I mean, uh, like Coach said, after the first four minutes, we were locked in and knew um, what to look for in their personnel and, um, you know, just playing together on defense. Um, well, I think it was definitely a team effort. I mean, a lot of his threes early on were catch and shoot threes. And uh, so, I mean, that came off of dual penetration. Uh, from different guys on their team. But I mean, once we were able to lock in on those guys, it was hard for them to score, especially off a of catch and shoot. I think like, this stuff we touched on before, I thought we did, like Steven said, we did a better job on some of the ball screens and limiting penetration so we weren't having to over help and getting stuck in line with a good shoot set threes. Um, we were scoring the whole game. I mean, early a lot with it was Steven getting, getting shots. So we, were, we were getting good shots the whole game. So we're just kind of taking care of little things defensively, making it tougher to score, and that gave us a chance to, to build a lead. Well, there's no doubt about it. He's an outstanding player. The reason he was player of the year last year, um, and he's been just as effective this year in a lot of ways. I mean, he draws a lot of attention. This is one of, honestly, the few teams that's both times we played him, really kind of played him one-on-one -on -one in there. And you can see with his field goal percentage and efficiency that uh, that's a pretty good pretty good for us. But he gets on the offensive end, he creates a lot of shots for people with the attention he draws. The one time they did try to double, Jimmy Soto's got the three out of the corner. And then, like I said, defensively, he changes so much stuff around the basket that uh, – that he can bail some guys out when they get beat? Um, just being aggressive. And uh, early on, uh, throughout the zone, when they were in the zone, we were able to move uh, without the ball. So, I mean, just finding gaps. And, uh, you know, a couple of teams were able to find me in the open spot and just being ready to shoot. I mean, I think that's the biggest thing that coaches keep harping on, just uh, when the ball comes to you, just being ready to shoot. And uh, just being confident, you know, coming on, work on it so much, and just applying it to the game and staying aggressive. Um, definitely not freshman year, uh, <laughs> but I mean, just uh, just coming with learning the game, getting the feel for the game and the way we're flowing throughout the game. I mean, uh, they early on, they were so worried about, um, you know, trails and stuff like that, you know, exact time is hidden behind. Uh, so just taking advantage of that. And, you know, once we got in the lane, we got a lot of other shots um, from kicking out and able to open up the middle definitely with Nana in the second half too. I mean, it's a big moment, you know, for all of us, it's just a great accomplishment. Um, you know, seeing so you try not to get too emotional between the game and, you know, all the honors and stuff. So, I mean, it's definitely a blessing uh, to get to this opportunity to be at Bucknell for four years and especially with a good group of guys that we have. Um, just cherishing the moment, just trying to take it all in uh, that I can and just enjoying it and then uh, just focusing on the game after that. Well, Herman Edwards will play to win the game. Okay. <laughs> That's why we play it. We're going down there to win. We got a chance to – we talked about it the other day. We talked about it again at the end. Um, no team in this league's history has ever won 16 regular season league games. It would be nice to do that. Um, we got an opportunity to go down there and, and play together one more time before the tournament, and we want to take full advantage of that and play our best.